Hey, Toby Chase. <clears throat> good morning, everybody. It is good to be on this trail. It is a little sad to be coming close to the end. Gonna hike today and tomorrow. Then I probably should be at the end. Whew. Pinch myself every day how great it is to be out here. It's uh, always tempered by a little sadness when you know not a lot of blazes left to follow. But, I don't know. We'll worry about all that when we get there. Right now, mossy wet stones. Beautiful smelling forest. And some colorful leaves starting to come down. Tiny, tiny. <laughs> Tiniest little mushrooms growing. They love the rain. Take a look in here. Hello. Yeah, it really, it feels like fall in this stretch here. With Moorhead behind us heading north. Maybe it's the trees. It's like a really cool day today. I think it's maybe 70 degrees. And uh, the softness from these leaves. I don't know. Feels like the season flipped just overnight. <laughs> Show to it. Got some power line views here. Short of that, this section just north of Moorhead doesn't really have much in the way of view, but it's pretty fun. It's uh, kind of going up and down along the ridge tops. Switching between trail and this little road. And they both kind of go the same way in the same, uh, the same direction, I guess. But the trail will just shoot off one side or the other for a few hundred yards and come back. But yeah, it's pretty nice. A lot of little ups and downs in this stretch. It's quite fun. No views though. And the sky is clear. The rain is gone. So, power line views it is. <laughs> so here, here's one of those splits. There goes the road and the trail goes up this way. And I bet you in well, I bet less than a quarter mile we'll be back on that road. <laughs> yep, and so, there's an arrow, and there's that road. <laughs> Joining it up. Mm. It seems those little side trails, yeah, they stopped. <laughs> Still walking along this gravel one. Just was checking on my maps and Looks like a couple miles now just on this road, but those are really enjoyable. Just uh, it breaks up the monotony of walking down the road. And they always kind of went up too higher, <laughs> which was kind of fun. This would be the interstate, I-64, uh, maybe. <laughs> All right, back to the trail. Oh, spider. Ah, man, it is like super webby in this stretch coming through. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. What the? Oh. 
<laughs> what is that? What? <laughs> what the hell? What is going on? <laughs> no way. No way. <laughs> Dude, did you do that? No. Clayton, maybe? <laughs> no way. <laughs> We're like in the middle of nowhere. And there's a big old knotty tree with a honey bun in it. <laughs> it's yeah, little Debbie. This is not even Little Debbie's. This is Freshly's territory. Oh, it smells good. <laughs> I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna take it. Maybe this is the treasure I'm always been looking for. It's a little dirty. Look at this. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> There's another one. Let me look in this one. Maybe there'll be a beer in that one. No, there's no <laughs> beer. Wow. I think I got me a honey bun. I'll split it with you, man. <laughs> <laughs> I got a magic honey bun from the Shell Toey Trace. Unbelievable. Awesome. Woo. <laughs> Anyways, it's super buggy in here, but... That doesn't really matter much anymore. <laughs> I think I broke my web breaker too. <laughs> Man. Hmm. That's listed as our water source in here. You can see it's not flowing very much. The trail runs, uh, runs down along it for a little while. So we'll crisscross it. And since we're going downhill, I'm hoping there's a little better water going on down there. But let's see. <laughs> if not, I think a couple of miles farther is uh, kind of where we plan to camp this evening. Is I think there's water up there. I hope there's water up there. But wow, score one honey bun. Oh man, getting covered in webs. I gotta keep my eyes on this trail. That's what I was saying before. Oh, I don't know if you can see it or not, but it is thick. One, two. Goodness. So, uh, Kind of am thinking, trying to figure out the honey bun situation, but if anybody put it in there for me, thank you. And if you put it in there for somebody else, I'm sorry, I took it. <laughs> but uh, I don't know. There's like web all in through here on both sides of that thing. So I don't think anybody's been in here today, but uh, I don't know. I guess I still can't figure it all out, but if that's magic for me, thank you. And if it's just magic for any old hiker, thank you. Honey bun found. <laughs> it's really dry in here. But there is another stream that we crossed a bridge about a mile down. So we press an eye. All right, Holly Fork Creek, water, good stuff. No time like the present. It's not even soggy, really. Mm. Little Debbie always delivers. Just don't let Mrs. Freshly know. <laughs> I think we're squarely in... Freshly territory here. 
maybe tasty cakes as well. Mmm. <laughs> Here's a bridge. Nice. <laughs> oh. Nothing to hang on in that middle part. <laughs> Alright, so here's the setup tonight. Got my chair, found that, rolled it up here, and a nice little path to my tent. There we go. Got the sun in the background. Got my food line hung right there. And see? And that is a perfectly good home for the night. Well, shoes, he's over here. Across the way. <laughs> and this, well, this is home. This will be the last night on the uh, Chateau Trace, I figure. It's only about a dozen miles, a little bit less even, from here to the end. That'll be for tomorrow. But beautiful little spot tonight. And water. Mm. And magic honey bun today. Ha <laughs> ha. Like, what is better than that? That was wild. That was wild. Yeah. All good. Good morning, everybody. It is a deliciously cool morning here on the Shell Toy Trace. Only cool morning. It seems like this cool. It was like 50s or something last night. Fantastic. But northbound again, as usual. Not a whole lot of blazes left ahead 10 miles or so probably from here gets us to the end ah. shell toy There is a beautiful water pump here on the Clark family. Oop, the Clark family farm. The trail cuts right by there and I think on their land. They uh, installed a pump out here. Yeah, with the blaze right on it. Real good water here. So, uh, topped off taking a break. I think the shoes is back there.
is uh, probably the spidieriest trail that I've ever hiked. That's for sure. Got him on my leg here. That's the, those are the spiders that we get most of the time. Sometimes it's those big red ones. Big spider queens. Oh my. Even those ones are fun. They're about the size of a quarter. And sometimes they hit you right in the head and drop down. They love my whiskers. <laughs> That big pancake and his brother. <laughs> what a trail this is. Just so many cool rocky waterfalls and big beautiful trees and all sorts of stuff along the way. The length, 340 some miles I think for us. It's not too bad. A great distance for someone trying it out through hiking, but magnificent place. You don't need to through hike it. A lot of the Red River Gorge and down the Big Fork, the Big South Fork down in Tennessee. Man, just fantastic stuff along the way. Absolutely loving this. I always hate it when it ends. Uh, it's been so much fun. Just every day, never sure what you're gonna get with the weather, with the rocks, the blowdowns, the critters you see. And man, I had a lot of fun. Yeah, hiking with shoes. Learned a lot about all well, the rhododendrons and the, just just learned a lot from them. And uh, I had a blast. So thank you, shoes, for inviting me down here. creek down here it's pretty dry let's see uh pretty close to the terminus now so i guess if you're starting out and you're heading southbound you might want to bring a little water with you to start <laughs> right here we'll cross it right here mm. just a little trickle that's all So just about at the end, Woo! I was thinking about it. When we started out down in Big South Fort, the end point down there was just a piece of paper, kind of laminated and nailed to the board. It just said terminus. So I'm not sure what we got waiting up ahead. I don't really expect much more than that, I guess. But it's been a remarkable trail, nevertheless. I guess there's only one way to find out. There's a trail behind. She's coming along. Let's get up here and see what this looks like. Shell toy. Woo. Better learn it from the start. <laughs> That's the blaze, baby. That's the blaze.
<laughs> I guess that is the final blaze. Little piece of it. There's a little one right here too, so. Completion. It's even less than I expected. I expected a paper laminated, but what a hike. What a hike. Well done, man. Woo! Good job, my friend. It's a lot of fun. <laughs>